What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If we're meeting for the first time, my name is Devin Durbin and I'm here to bring you the tools, tips, and tricks to make you more self-sufficient. So today on the channel, we're talking about repairing some patio furniture. So I recently had a door rip off patio, uh, patio table. Um, I'm going to fix it today. I thought it was a great project to bring you guys along on. Stay tuned. So we're looking at the side of my table here. Uh, what happened was this bracket down here actually, uh, the anchor nut broke out of the actual, uh, the actual aluminum frame here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this anchor nut off this bracket and I'm gonna drill a through hole here so that we can put a bolt straight through this support arm here. So it basically looks the opposite of this it's going to pin up in our door here. And you know, th this, this allows the door to swing and this mounts into our frame down there. So let's go ahead and remove this anchor nut from our little bracket here. All right, so this bracket fully supports the bolt I wanna use or a little machine screw. Um, it's gonna go through the frame and then I'm gonna put a, a uh, washer and a nut on it just like that. So let's go ahead and drill our 7 16 hole through the frame to accept this. So literally all I'm doing is drilling a hole where this anchor nut once was um, that we just took out here. It basically just tore out of the sheet metal you can see that this was all that was supporting it was this little bit of sheet metal. Um, these anchor nuts basically sit in a void inside the furniture. And that's all that you have when it comes to uh, the uh, rigidity of it. So let's go ahead and drill a hole straight through the frame. We're gonna have a nut on the outside. We can paint it if we want, but not a deal breaker. So I'm not sure if I said 7 sixteenths. Um, that was not what I was thinking. Um, it is 17 sixty-fourths. So we're just going to uh, line it up straight through here. Once again, this is really, really thin stuff here. So we just want to uh, be careful, go slow, and drill it out here. Boom, just like that. So. Now we can attach our, our bracket back on here, just like this, and allow us to put our door back on. As simple as that. So let's go ahead and get our door over here. We're gonna slide it up into the bottom of the door because this supports it. And then uh, we're gonna go ahead and tighten our nut and washer on there. All right, one thing you want to take into consideration when doing a repair like this is this sheet metal is, or these uh, aluminum supports are very thin. So as you can see where it pulled out, you want to make sure that you're not over tightening it and, uh, you know, 
messing it up further. So we got the bracket back in there. The gap looks good here on the side of the door. Now with something like this um, patio table, it has a pull out a little cart that holds your propane tank. So the biggest culprit of breaking that uh, anchor point back there is not having this uh, properly adjusted to roll around with your heavy propane tank on there. So keep that in mind if you have a table just like this. So that wraps up the video. There's a quick simple tip on how to uh, fix a simple piece of patio equipment. We're gonna get this thing washed up and uh, get it back out on the deck. All right guys, hope you enjoyed the little fix and just how I did it. Um, there are other solutions. Um, you could use all kinds of stuff from JD Weld to, uh, you know, just welding it up, uh, getting somebody to weld it back uh, with a TIG welder. There's all kinds of options. That's just the option that I chose to take uh, real quick, fast, and easy. You can spray paint over the nut and nobody knows the wiser. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you guys are into. And uh, interact with me in the comments below. I hope to see you subscribe to the channel. And if you're one of my longtime subscribers, I guess we'll see you in the next video.